Hey everybody, welcome back. We have another TTM video to start the week. Look at that eight beautiful returns. We send our favorite athletes and celebrities cards and photographs TTM through the mail. That's all that stands for. We know we've got one. It's non-machinable coming from Tampa, St. Pete. We know that who that is. We've only sent one non-machinable out, so we'll stick that somewhere in the middle and start right off with Las Vegas, Nevada. Did not trust my Dollar Tree envelopes. Put tape all the way across. Las Vegas. NV. Whoa. Wrapped in paper. Rick Upchurch. Nice, nice. First time we've gotten him back. First time we sent to him. Uh, I've done some trades with Upchurch involved in the past. I think the dealmaker Kernan has uh, sold me some Upchurch autographs. I wonder what his rookie is. I need to get his rookie card. He was a really great player. Nine seasons, 75 to 83. And four times in a Pro Bowl. And he's one of those guys. He's on the all-decade team in the 1970s and the 1980s. Take a look at that career there. Big-time returner. Kickoffs and punts. And that's one of the reasons he made the all-decade team. In addition to him being a quality receiver. Catching passes from Craig Morton. And got there just after Elway got there, I guess. So he retired. He's 70 years old. And if you're on the all-decade team, you've got a little foot in the door at the Hall of Fame. But um, 267 lifetime receptions with 4,300 yards and 5,400 return yards. He holds 11 Broncos records. And... Uh, Put in their ring of honor. 19 dated Condoleezza Rice. How about that? Secretary of State under President Obama, Condoleezza Rice. They dated in the 1970s. It's been out about three months. First time we've sent to him. Let's see. 67, 74, 81, 83, 4, 86 days. No fee. Rick Upchurch. Need to find his rookie card and send that out. Charlotte, North Carolina. Second up today. Curtis Strange, I just sent this out. Nice. I think I got these from the dealmaker, too. Sent us a pack of cards. And two Curtis Strange cards went there. Didn't know if he signed dupes. Got that great kind of left-handed slant autograph. Blue ink really picks up on that chartreuse golf shirt he's got. Nice. Hall of Famer. 67 years old. He's a color commentator now. He's in the World Golf Hall of Fame as of 2007. Won two U.S. Opens, and in the late 80s, he dominated the game. 29 career wins. 86 to 90, he was on top of his game and one of the leading golfers in the world. Uh, just a week, seven days, no fee, Curtis Strange. I was prepared to wait six months for that. Next up, Richmond, VA, Richmond, Virginia. Richmond, Virginia. Another Hall of Famer, Rod Langway. First time we sent to him. That's his rookie right there. Nice, nice. 1980 OPG. That's the rookie. This is a 1984 OPG. Pretty sweet. That's the card that we got for the Kurt Frazier. No, that's not the one. Still have that one, I guess. I'm resend to him. I wait about six months and resend. That's what my typical plan is. Send about every six months to guys with no fees. If the person has a fee, then I, I'm not afraid to send right back out to them. That's been out about three weeks. He's 65 years old. He was a defenseman for 17 years. 77 to 93. Canadians, as you see. Capitals, as you see. And the Capitals ended up retiring his jersey number. Number five. Six times in the All-Star game and won the Norris Trophy as the best defenseman two times. They called him the Secretary of Defense. First team All-Star and winner of the Norris Trophy. That was the first year he won it, I suppose. In just under three weeks, 20 days, no fee, Hall of Fame 2002, Rod Langway. Nice. First time we've sent to all three of these gentlemen. That's cool. Phoenix, Arizona. Phoenix, Arizona. Who can it? We got my note back. Mr. Jordan. Steve Jordan. 89 score. Got one of these back on Thursday. Who did we get back? With the 89 score. Mark Carrier signed it in purple. 
Steve Jordan, 91 pro set, making a great catch. 89 score. 62-year-old. He played tight end for 13 seasons. Long career here. 82 to 94, and he played all of them for the Minnesota Vikings. Kind of a Vikings legend. He had a great career. Um, six times in the Pro Bowl. What? Six? Underrated player. 50 greatest Vikings, about 500 receptions in his career. 6,300 yards and 28 touchdowns. He's the father of Cam Jordan, who's been playing for the Saints for the last 12 seasons. And Cam was seven times in the Pro Bowl. That's been out over a month. He, he'll, he'll take a while, but he'll get him back to you. 37, 44 days. 44 days, no fee. Steve Jordan, father of Cam Jordan. Defensive tackle, Saints. Tampa St. Pete. This is our non-machinable. Thick card. And it's signed. Nice. 71 top super with his facsimile autograph with a star on the dotted his eye. Dick Bosman. Really nice. Forget where I got this. Maybe from Greg Moore's cards. It was kind of a throw in, maybe. Got it really inexpensively. There's the 70 tops and the 68. Dick Bosman, 78 years old, right handed pitcher from Kenosha, Wisconsin. Speaking of Troy, the dealmaker, Curtin, that's his hometown. Pretty cool. He's met Dick Bosman a couple times. He comes back to town for card shows and autograph signings. Local card shop brings him back. That's really cool. It survived the mail. No harm, no foul. It's a really stiff card. You can see how thick it is. But you got to non-machine that and put some extra postage on there. Um, led the AL in ERA in 1969. He threw a no-hitter in 1974, and he missed a perfect game. Why? Well, he's the only player in Major League history. He lost a perfect game because of his own throwing error. Fourth inning. Had a throwing error. Got allowed the runner to reach first base. Later got them in a double play, so got the no-hitter. Didn't get the perfect game. Nine days, no fee, Dick Bosman. Seattle, Washington up next. Washington, there's Jim Zorn's rookie. We're about to see this soon. 77 tops rookie card. It's the only card I've seen in Proverbs 22.6. Raise your child the way they should go, and when they're older, they will not turn from it. How about that? One of my faves. Jim Zorn on the rookie. We're about to see this again because I sent this to Beckett to get slabbed. And those Beckett slabs are due back any day, maybe this week. So we shall see. Brandon let me know that they were being mailed. How about that? We're going to see that in a Beckett slab. I think I sent that. Sent so many cards to Brandon. I forget uh, which cards I sent now. But that's just over two weeks, 15 days, no fee for Jim Zorn. 69 years old, played quarterback for 13 seasons, nine of which for those Seahawks. He teamed up with a great Hall of Famer, Steve Largent. A lot of his receptions, a lot of his completions and touchdowns were to Mr. Largent. And he became a longtime coach after his playing days. I think he's a GM of the XFL team in Seattle now. Orlando, Florida, 15 days, no fee, Jim Zorn. Orlando, Flo Rida. Two more left. John Castino. Diamond King. Nice. In the 82 Donruss, is that his rookie? I believe, no. No, it's not. Really great player. Kind of a shame he was cut short by injury. There he is at third base for the first three years of his career. Look at those stirrups with the Twin Cities logo on them. Pretty sweet. <laughs> Gotta love those. And there's the reverse image of that by the great Dick Perez on the Diamond King. Yep, great player. 83, he's already on the Diamond King card. They knew how good he was going to be. He's 68 years old. Really promising career. Cut short. Rookie of the year in 79. As a third baseman, then hit 302 the following year and led the league in triples with nine. And then the following year after that, he switched into second base and he led the league in fielding percentage. After that, though, his bad back. Bad back popped up and really just... Ended his career right there. But they voted him one of the 50 greatest twins. They knew his promise. Over two weeks, uh, 14, 18 days, no fee. John Castino, great player, cut short. What if? What could have happened? Last one, Kansas City. Uh, Kansas City. Doesn't say Missouri or Kansas. Kansas City. 
Joe Carter, yes, he signed it. Nice, nice. $5 fee. We've seen this card in a recent Mail Day episode. Played outfielder in first base. This is 84 TCMA. And his rookie card is the 84 Donruss. We got that card the same day. But when you're dealing with Joe Carter, you should only send him one card at a time. And I know some people have had success sending him two and $10. But I have not. And lost a card one time. He returned one and kept the 10. So I only send him one at a time. He does have a $5 fee. It's been out under three weeks. Let's see. 19 days. $5 fee. And then I'll send him the 84 Donruss. Like I said, I'll send him right back to him with a fee. Really great player. Borderline Hall of Famer. If he gets in, who would care? Nobody would care. Great career. Just under 400 homers. I think he had 398, 396. 1,500 RBIs, 2,200 hits, five times in the All-Star game, and a two-time World Series winner, including his great walk-off win, hit a home run in Game 6 in 1993. He's a member of the Canadian Baseball Hall of Fame in 2003. His walk-off and Bill Mazeroski's uh, home run were the only walk-off home runs in World Series history. Mazeroski's was in Game 7. Joe Carter's was in Game 6. So sometimes you hear that Maz was the only walk-off home run in Game 7. And that is true. All right, what'd you think? Let me know down below what your favorite was. A lot of great ones today. Jim Zorn, rookie. Uh, Dick Bosman, super. Steve Jordan. Uh, Langway's rookie. Got to have that for uh, Brian. Going to love that one. <laughs> Curtis Strange, got him back in a week. Wow. Okay, Joe Carter, rookie. Or uh, pre-rookie. What'd you think? Let me know, of course. And if you haven't subbed yet, Click that icon right there and then ring that bell or click all and you'll be notified of all my future videos. Instead of having to go search for them, they'll just pop up there in your notifications and let you know that I posted a new one. I post about uh, four videos a week, so keep your eyes open for those. And if you missed last Thursday's TTM video, uh, I'll leave a link to that one right there. Thanks for being with me today and we will see you soon.